So they feel uh, kind of like um, a minority group that is in decline. And uh, they feel that um, people of color are rising and they are declining. Now, you and I know that if we look at Blacks in the last 30 years, that household income uh, has uh, not risen in the last 30 years and that 2008, they had their money in, in their houses and they lost that. And you and I know that education, you know, affirmative action didn't bump them ahead of uh, poor whites. But that doesn't, um, at, at they, that's not on their radar. If we focus on their radar, uh, which is, comes from this, from that mass media, um, they're sinking and others are rising. Um, I asked them, well, how about Trump? Has Trump helped, helped you here in Eastern Kentucky, actually? Are there more coal jobs? No. Uh, he promised them, but they're not there. Are there new industries come in? Well, not really. Uh, is your water any cleaner? No. Um, is, uh, um, is the opiate crisis uh, more in control? No. So actually nothing. <laughs> Life isn't better for them four years later, but they're still voting for him. And um, I think uh, part of that is that they're going for the wish. And the other part of it is they don't see the Democratic Party. They, it just doesn't have a face there. It's uh, nobody is, is seems to be reaching out for them. You know, uh, it, it's a, there's an invisibility. You know, here's what the Democrats are trying to do. Here's a bipartisan effort. There's nothing on that.